Hallelujah. God, <laughs> he has a way of changing things around. Hallelujah. <laughs> God said, you need to share some things. I said, okay, Lord. Hallelujah. I want to give you a little background where I came from. Hallelujah. Because he gets all the glory and all the honor and all the praise all the time. Amen. Hallelujah. Because if it wasn't for Jesus Christ, I would not be here. Amen. I would be ten feet under and a lot of us would be ten feet under as well.
the great exchange. You were the old and the misfit and down and out and addicted. And then you come into the love of your life. His name is Jesus. And you're totally changed. Thank you, Lord. Right. Totally changed. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Lord has done. There's nothing impossible with our God. Amen? Amen. There's Amen. nothing impossible. No. You know, I didn't have to go to AA, NA, or anywhere else. Come on, but Jesus come on, come the come Holy on. Ghost. Holy That's Ghost. Right. Holy Lord. Ghost. Lord. The Holy Ghost came in and I'm like, whoo! What is this? Yeah! <laughs> so it'll high like the most high God. Amen? Yeah. Hallelujah. I got high. Hallelujah. Nothing else took that place. Amen. <laughs> you can get drunk in the high in the Holy Ghost. Amen. <laughs> Hallelujah. But you got to get out of yourself. You got to get out of the old you and come into the new you. Yeah. The new man in Christ. Amen. Thank you, Lord. The new man. Old things have passed away and old, um, all things have become new. From the top of your head to the soles of your feet. You're brand new. Hallelujah. Amen. I had a blood disorder. I had leukemia. You know, God healed that too as well. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. He has all things. Amen. Like all things. All things. All things. Wow. And I, I said, Lord, I just don't understand why people just don't get all done like I was all done. I didn't know you at all. But I fell in love with you. Thank I you. fell in love with the name Jesus. Thank you, Lord. I fell in love with love. You've got to fall in love with love. If you're really in love with somebody, pastor and his wife, pastor and his wife, many couples, if you're really in love, you're in love. You're not, oh, well, that looks nice over there. You're not like that. Right. You're not going to compromise. You're not going to, you know, look around and think about other things. You're in love. Right. Amen. Right. Amen. Right. You're in love with Jesus. Yes. Woo. Hallelujah. He's your husband Amen. until you get married. Amen. Hallelujah. He's your, he's your wife until you get married. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's everything you have need of. Everything. Everything. Glory to God. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory. He is a mighty, mighty God. Mighty God. Awesome God. Hallelujah. My title is, Have You Lost Your Identity? <laughs> have you lost your identity, huh? A lot of people have lost their identity. They don't know who they are in the Lord anymore. A lot of people say, oh, don't talk to me about the Holy Ghost. We don't do that anymore in our church. I was like, what? You don't, you're stopping the spirit of the living God from moving in your church? You're stopping the living God from even coming out of your lips. You're not praying in the spirit. You're not allowing the Holy Ghost to move. You don't see signs and wonders anymore. I said, I was crying. I said, oh my goodness. How can you do that? How can you be so excited and, and so changed and then say, no, no, I don't want that anymore. No. No, I'm going to do it my own way. You know the song, we, we're going to go his way. Amen. That's our, our song. We're going his way. Amen. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. We're going to go his way. In Galatians 3 1. Let me turn there if you want. Hallelujah. Who has bewitched you? Glory to God. This is an interesting thing the Lord brought to me. Hallelujah. Who has tricked you? Who has changed your mind? Who has taken you out of the love of your life? Boy, hallelujah. Who has twisted things in your ears to think about there isn't a God? He's not big enough. He's not great enough. Amen? He's not a healer. He's not a deliverer. He, he can't do any of these things anymore. Who has bewitched you? This was Paul talking to the Galatians. Amen? And I said, well, God, are you talking to us? <laughs> He's funny. <laughs> God has a great sense of humor. He goes, yep, talking to you. Who has bewitched you? You know, 
I don't know if you'll go on the internet or you're in any of the areas of different uh, ministries or different things or even in the public a lot. If you really listen to people and they say, what comes out of their mouth? What time they can say, oh yes, I'm trusting Jesus. No, no, I'm not going to trust him. He didn't answer my prayer fast enough. Uh -oh. Or, oh, no, I'm not going to go back to that church. I was offended. No, I'm not going to go back there. Oh, no, I'm not going to go there anymore because uh, they talk in tongues all the time. Oh. All these things. You're going to hear more and more of this. The deception is very, very wild yes, moving is. right now. Yes, it is. And now is the time to know who you are in Christ yes. and who Christ is in you. Amen? Yes. Hallelujah. We don't walk away from what God has given us. Amen? Amen. How can you walk away from life? Amen? Amen? We live and move and have our being because of Jesus. Amen? Because of the anointing of God. Because of the Holy Ghost. Because of what Jesus did on the cross. Amen? Amen. Because of what Jesus did on the cross. Shed His blood for us. Amen? Amen. The stripes He took for us. Amen? Amen? Hallelujah. He took it. He was nailed where we should have been nailed. He took the punishment where we should have been punished. That's right. Hallelujah. That's right. And on the third day He rose again to give us life and life more abundantly. Hallelujah. Woo! Thank you, Lord. Woo! So who has bewitched you? Don't be listening to those negative words. Don't be listening to the, the big mouth in your ear. <laughs> that was got big mouth. He doesn't whisper. He's got big mouth. Oh, yeah. The, the small, still voice is coming out of your spirit. That's what we listen to. Amen? Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. He guides us and leads us and directs us. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. So we have to be transformed by the renewing of our mind. Amen? By the Word of God. Hallelujah. Transformed. We're being transformed every day. By the Word of God. Amen? Amen. Every Sunday we're being hearing the Word and we should be transformed when we walk out of here. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. you got to hold on fast to that Word that's coming to you. Amen? Because the devil's right there to pluck it out. As soon as you walk out that door, it can be gone. You can be healed in here, walk out the door and go, oh, I still feel that. I, I, you know, it's still there. Don't do that. Hallelujah. God wants us to grow up and start trusting His Word. Amen? Yeah. Grow up and, and say, Lord, I'm healed, I'm healed, and devil, get off my path. Amen? Sure. You're a liar, you're a deceiver, you're defeated. Hallelujah. Yeah. And I've got the victory. Amen? Yeah. That's right. Right down the bottom of your shoes. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. He's defeated. You have the victory. Amen? Right. Hallelujah. To be filled up in Him. Amen? Amen. Filled up. Hallelujah. Be filled up in Him. Be encouraged. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Share with somebody the good news. Everybody out there is hearing bad news. Oh my goodness, there's so many bad news. Dying, shooting, whatever, never. Around my neighborhood, I hear it all the time. I see it all the time. And, and, and drugs and the prostitutes. And, and my heart goes out to them. Hallelujah. Uh, and you, uh, you reach out to them and just tell them, oh, Jesus loves them. And they don't know what to do. Yeah. And I said, come here. I, I just want to hug you. I just want to give you a hug. And they're like, no, don't touch me. I want to hug them. I hug them anyway. <laughs> because I want to tell them how much I love them. How much God loves them. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. They, they know my name. They see me. I'm Wendy. I'm busy. I'm <laughs> in this house. <laughs> Hallelujah. But I know God's word does not come back void. Amen? Right. It accomplishes where do we believe it. It's probably where we get word sent by us. Amen? Amen? Hallelujah. And you don't know. Ron is right here. He knows. Hallelujah. They're going to come in. I claim them. So it's enough. Start claiming them. When you're driving, you're walking, start claiming people. Thank you, Lord, for the salvation. Thank you, Lord, for the salvation. Thank you, Lord, for the deliverance. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We're going to see him come in. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes. You're going to see him come running up to you and say, i got to have this Jesus. All right. i got to have him. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. We're going to see people running to us. Are we going to be ready? Are we going to be ready? Yes, 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 yes. yes. i got the word for you. i got it. i got it. i got the word. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to lay hands on the sick and they're going to recover. Amen? Amen. We're going to cast out those devils. Hallelujah. Right. We're not going to let them sit there and be our pet. 
Right. Amen. Hallelujah. No. I just heard that the other night. It was so funny. You let your pet devil with you? No. I cast him out. <laughs> Look at your neighbor. You got a pet devil? Tell him to get out. <laughs> get out, devil. <laughs> yeah. So those, those hidden ones, you know, they come up once in a while and go, come on. Nobody knows. God won't see. Let's go over here. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> you know the one that kind of sneaks up in your pocket and goes, Yeah, I'm going to go outside and do a little here or smoke over here. Nobody will know. God knows. Your body knows. Amen. Hallelujah. You're hurting your body. You're hurting the temple of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Hallelujah. You're not hiding anything from God. He knows everything. He knows what you're thinking about. He knows what you're planning to do. Amen. Everybody goes, oh, God doesn't know. I said, mm, you don't know God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Amen. He loves us so much. He doesn't want us to stay like we are. Yeah. He wants us to grow up in Him. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. To go up higher in Him. Go up deeper in Him. Amen. And do those greater works that He called us to do. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Signs and wonders will follow those who believe. Amen. Right. Not the ones that are sitting up in the pulpit. Those who believe, we're all believers. Amen? Yeah. 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 Right. Amen. To those who believe, hallelujah. Right. Hallelujah. So we can go into Walmart and preach the gospel. Yeah, people are going to get saved, healed, and delivered. Right. Hallelujah. We've gone and prayed in the Walmart. People got, got healed. Hallelujah. <laughs> got saved. <Amen>. <laughs> <laughs> hallelujah. We're going to be bold. Amen? Be bold. Hallelujah. Soul for Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Pray to you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In Ephesians 1, 7 through 11, we have salvation. We have redemption. Let's see if we can go there. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory. We have to believe what God is giving us. What God has given us. We have to believe what... God gives us the word when we read it, when we hear it. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. Believe it and take it for yourself. Amen? Amen. Take it for yourself. Just say, that's mine. Do you know that's how you get from God? You want healing? Say, Lord, I want, that's mine. When you hear a testimony of somebody being healed, and you say, okay, God did it over my ears. You're saying your ears are plugged? Oh, thank you, Lord. I'm, I'm going to take that for myself. I take that for myself. That's how we get healed. That's how we take it in faith. Amen? Amen. We don't want to lose our identity. Amen? We want to hold our identity in faith. Amen? And not in being bewitched or tricked or deceived. Hallelujah. No more. Amen? Amen. Okay, Ephesians uh, 7. Glory. In Him we have redemption. Uh-huh. In Him we have deliverance. Yes. Put your name in there. I, whoever, <laughs> whatever your name is, put it in there. I have redemption in Him. I have deliverance in Him. I have salvation in Him. Amen? Yes. His blood, the remission, the forgiveness of our offenses, our shortcomings, our trespasses. Woo! In accordance with the, the riches and the generosity of His favor. Thank you, Lord. His gracious favor. Amen? Praise Him. Hallelujah. His favor surrounds us like a shield. Amen? Amen? Hallelujah. Are you believing it? Are you receiving it? Yes. Hallelujah. I thank you, Lord, for the anointing of God is here to destroy every yoke and remove every burden yes. off of everyone here. Yes, in the name Lord. of yes. Jesus. I, I come against these things, trying to block ears and block hearts right now in the name of Jesus. Yes. I command you to take your hands and, <laughs> and talking off their ears right now in the name of Jesus. Loose their ears, loose their hearts right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Satan, you are defeated. You are defeated. <clears throat> Out. In Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. The anointing of God is here. Yes. Hallelujah. To destroy every yoke and remove every burden. 
In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. And I thank you, Lord, for ahead of time, for healing, for miracles, yeah. for deliverances. Yeah. Right now, in the, yeah. in the name of Jesus. 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 Signs and wonders will follow the word of God. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God. In Him, we also were made God's heritage. And we obtain inheritance. We have been ordained and chosen. Woo! Ha, appointed before Him in accordance with His purpose. Who works out everything in agreement with the counsel and the design of His own will. Wow! Woo! I know that's probably a little deep. But it's right there. It's right there. It's given to you, right there. Take it. It's yours. Receive it. Hallelujah. This is what Jesus has given us. Amen? Amen. We don't want to lose our identity. We don't want to lose. We want to gain. Amen? We want to multiply. Yes. Our God's in the multiplying business. Amen? In the adding business. Devils in subtracting and dividing. Right. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Yeah, he is. Uh huh. But he's defeated. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. And Isaiah 61, he says, "The Spirit of the Lord God is upon me." Yeah. Amen. Yeah. He's anointed to preach, to teach the good news. Amen. Right. You say it. The Spirit, Spirit of the Lord, of the Lord God, God is upon, upon me. me. Oh, well, wow. hallelujah. <laughs> I don't think they really believe that. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Let's do this again. The Spirit of the Lord is upon me. me. He has anointed me. Come on, He has anointed me. He has anointed me. Amen. Hallelujah. I'm not going to lay hands on the sick, and they're going to recover. Amen. I'm going to go cast out devils. Amen. I'm going to go cleanse the lepers. And I'm going to go raise the dead. Amen? Yes. Hallelujah. That's what's inside of us. That's when you get the Holy Ghost. That's what's inside of you. The Spirit of the Lord is upon you. It's on us. Amen? Amen. Woo! Glory! Woo! <laughs> hallelujah. Hallelujah. Go to Isaiah 61. I got it. Yeah, hallelujah. I want to give you a little bit more. So where to go? He's anointed and qualified us to preach or teach. Amen? Qualified. You're all ministers. Amen? Amen. Amen. <laughs> hallelujah. Wow. Lord, <laughs> come on here. Yeah. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> to share the good news. Is there any good news? Yeah, come on. Yeah. What's the good news? The Lord. Jesus. The Spirit of the Lord. The Lord. <laughs> <laughs> you all pass. <laughs> okay. So we have the anointing in us to go to the meek, the poor, the afflicted. He has sent me to bind up and heal the brokenhearted. To proclaim liberty to those that are physically and spiritually captive. Mm -hmm. To open the prison and the eyes to those that are bound. Do you know we're in prison more than the prisoners? In our own right here. Right here. Right here. We read it. We speak it. And we're still in bondage. Because we don't take it in. You gotta take it in. You gotta take the word in like with new wine, amen? You gotta take it in like that cool water. When you're saying that cool water. <laughs> cool water. Cooling water. <laughs> Have you been thirsty? Cooling water. Have you really been thirsty? Yes. To that point you you just couldn't get enough? What did you do? You just drinking. sat there, the water's here? What do you do? You gonna you didn't go up there and you're gonna get the water? Oh, yeah.